Hi there, welcome to How to d and My name's Frederick Willer and today I'm going to talk about the spell Lightning Bolt. This is part of my Dungeons and Dragons 5e spell video series. You can find Lightning Bolt on 255 of the player's handbook. Lightning Bolt is a third level spell. It is an evocation spell so you create an elemental effect and in this case it is lightning. It has a casting time of one action which means you can't cast a bonus action spell in the same round or make an attack with your weapon in the same round. You can only cast that lightning bolt. It has a range of self and travels a hundred foot in a straight line. It has a verbal, semantic and material component so you perform a magical gesture, speak a few arcane words and have to use a bit of fur and a rod of amber, crystal or glass. It is instantaneous. A stroke of lightning forming a line of 100 feet long and 5 feet wide blasts out from the direction that you direct it in. Each creature in the line must make a dexterity saving throw. Any creature caught in the lightning bolt takes 8 6 sided dice worth of lightning damage on a failed save and half that much on a successful save. So no matter what, you're going to do a lot of damage. Lightning Bolt ignites flammable objects in the area if they are not worn or carried. So the wizard here casts Lightning Bolt from them, straight out, and just draw a line. And as long as you can draw a line through your targets, so there are five targets here. So we're going to have to make five dexterity saving throws for the orcs. The magical DC for this wizard is 13, so DC equals 13. Each orc has a dexterity saving throw of plus one, so we roll these five dice. So what do I get? So five plus one is six. 12 plus one is 13. 16 plus one is 17. 16 plus 1 is 17 again, and 14 plus 1 is 15. So the 6 fails, the 13 succeeds, 17 succeeds, 17 succeeds, and 15 succeeds. So now we roll our damage. Oh, there's a lot of damage there. Here we go. It's not looking good. It's going to be some crispy critters today. Serves them right for standing in a nice, convenient, straight line. Okay, so we have 6, plus 2, plus 6, plus 5, plus 3, plus 3, plus 3, plus 6. It's going to be nasty. So the maximum damage is 34. 15, 12, is 17. Half of that is 17. So that means that... Pretty much every single orc in that straight line is now going to be dead because I'm pretty sure orcs don't have 17 hit points. Nope, they don't. So goodbye, zap, 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 and they all get crispified and die. Apart from the one that wasn't standing in the straight line. Very sensible to spread yourself out when dealing with uh, corridors. At higher levels, lightning bolt does more damage. So when you cast the spell at a spell slot of level 4 rather than level 3, you get to do one additional six-sided dice worth of damage. So you get nine rather than eight six-sided dice. Uh, every time you cast the spell at another level higher than three, you get an additional six-sided dice. So at level four, you get nine. At level five, you get ten dice, and so forth. Lightning Bolt is a very powerful spell, really helpful when everything lines up in a nice straight line. It's a little bit situational because that doesn't really happen all the time. If you found this video helpful, please share, like, and subscribe. I do this every single week. There is another one next week. Make a comment below if you have any questions about Lightning Bolt. I will answer those questions. And if there's anything that I missed, add them in the comments. Till next week, keep rolling those 20s.